Hi guys, today I'm on my toy hunt. Right now I'm at Target. They have a cool squeezable display case area. Look at this little dessert ice cream thing. It's weird because it's like literally on the ground. So <laughs> I want to grab this waffle. Oh, that's so cute. So a, a, a different type of squeezable there. And then up here they have these little mini box packs. Is that a froggy? That's cute. So you get two visible characters and then one mystery one. So it looks like the packs repeat, um, but that's cute. They're they're super tiny. I like the art style on their dessert ones. That's pretty neat. Oh, look at that one has fangs. If it's a little spider or bat, <laughs> pretty cute. Squeezables have a very cute design. And down the sort of Shopkins aisle, they still have some of the um, party popper little secret play sets. Which look very cute. Not sure if I'm going to pick these ones up. I'll probably pick up the lockets. I don't know. I I need to decide on that. They do have some things on clearance. Um, the My Little Pony Cutie Mark Crew Series 1 are on clearance. Um, that's awesome. I need to find some Series 2. The Cutie Car Set. They have Party Pop Teenies. Moving on to Num Num Silly Shakes. I love those. Oh wow, some of the snow cones, um, that's the Wave 2 ones, are also on clearance. We have more My Little Pony. I'm looking for the the Shimmer series, but this Target doesn't have any. Cool, it's sort of a, a random mix. Let's see, down here, okay, so one of you guys said that these are the Series 2 Pygmy Pops, which I didn't even notice. I was like, oh, that's a different color, but yeah, they have um, this little pineapple guy on the front, so that's awesome. Let me take a look at the checklist and show you guys. So this is the Pick Me Flip Series 2. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. This is hard to do one-handed. I almost have it. Nope. Ah, uh, I don't. <laughs> the struggle is real. Okay. Here, here we go. Kind of. So some of them are like little fruit animals. Very cute. There's a dog with a mermaid tail. So they have some mermaids. That's sort of been a thing. And they have... I like the pineapple character, so that's interesting and cute. That one's super colorful. Um, these are $9.99 at Target. So that's the first series. So you just have to kind of look closely at the tag. And then this color is definitely new that you can easily tell is a, a series too. So super cute. Um, Pick Me Pops are always adorable. And I like the little food theme going on. Awesome. It looks like there's 12 new characters to collect. Very cool. And then moving on here, they have some Hatchimals, LOL Surprise Pets. Um, not too much else. They have some of the bigger Pick Me Pop plush. And then some of the Spirit, which are cute. I actually like those a lot. Target has a side cap with a bunch of Fortnite stuff. I don't remember seeing this figure, which actually looks really cool, just as an action figure. Um, so they have a bunch of other ones. They have these little mini packs, which I haven't seen these before, but you know I like mini figures. These are actually really cool. Um, they're pretty nicely done, too. So I think they have like four different packs. We've seen that pack before. And then they have a bunch of the other action figures there. Um, the pinata thing. <laughs> I don't play Fortnite, so I don't know. They also have some new Transformers. The, the Siege figures. That's cool. These are the little mini ones. And then over here, there's some more. They're all really small, but still very neat. Transformers are always, always good. <laughs> always good toys. So, cool stuff. And then Minecraft has a new series. Series 14 is the Chinese Mythology series. Okay, that looks pretty awesome. Look at the dragon on the box there. So here's a look at the ones you can get. Huh. Oh, look at the panda. That is so cool. I like the packaging. What a neat idea. They had the Greek mythology and now Chinese mythology. That's awesome. Good job, Minecraft. Those, those look exciting. 
So now I'm at Walmart looking at sort of their end cap display, or these are in, in the middle of the aisles. I think this is left over from the holiday season. But they do have these little squeezable blind boxes. These are a different series. Um, they had similar ones for the holiday, which were adorable. But I've been seeing a lot on Instagram of clearance items, but not my Walmart, or at least where I live. <laughs> not, not much going on there, but I'll keep my eye out. And then moving on, I'll just kind of scan the toys. There's um, the little big bites. There's a bunch, which these look cute. I haven't opened them. But they look kind of fun that you stick your finger in there and it bites it. And that's how you open your toy. That's cute. They also have these Moj Moj. Um, I think those are like the, those squishy, crunchy pets. That sounded weird. They have some slime. Um, some Pick Me Pops. These are the Series 1 flips. Oh, look at it. how cute. There's like a mommy and baby kitty for the soft and slow squishies. Then on this side, they have some Barbie stuff. Look at the SpongeBob outfit and Patrick's the purse. Can, can we just... That's actually really adorable. And then there's some of the little pooperoo thingies. Let's see. Oh, these are cool. They're like little fast food um, lip glosses, but you get a squishy. Let's see. Oh, it feels really, really soft. I don't think it's slow rising, but they feel very, very soft. Some fingerling stuff. And then a lot more uh, Barbies and fashionistas. And down the toy aisle, oh my goodness, they have the new poopsie critters, the sparkly critters. <gasps> Eek, these look so cute. Oh, that's awesome. So, um, these are $14.98. But the packaging is adorable. You get your figure. Oh, look at it. There's like a fishy one. I think they're all unicorns. Um, oh, there's a kitty. I like the dragon. Oh my goodness, the dragon. Okay, the dragon is goals. <laughs> the dragon's adorable. Um, and it looks like there's 12 to collect. Or 15 to collect. My bad. So, that's awesome. Um, and you, let's see, you make the slime inside your little figure or something like that. They have the larger unicorn poopsie ones. Oh, that's so cool. Let me kind of scan over things. The LOL outfit of the day. Some smushy mushy. They have a lot of those larger pick me pops plush. I actually have a ton. Ooh, and they also have hair goals for LOL Surprise. It's been a while since before the holidays since I found those, so that's awesome. So they have like a full case. They actually have more on the bottom here. Cute! And that's the latest doll series. They even have the Num Num Surprise in a Bottle, which those are adorable. I can't... I'm obsessed with these. They are so cute. I can't wait for the next wave to come out. And then down here there's a lot more dolls. Oh wow, they have the Blink series. I've seen these once before the holidays and I never saw them again, so yeah. Definitely check Walmart if you, you didn't get these and they have a full case in back. That's crazy. That's awesome. I still actually have a few to open, so I'm good. But they have more of the LOL hair goals. Um, I think there's a full case. Yeah, that looks unopened back there. So that's really cool. I'm glad things are restocking for after the holidays because it was, it was sparse <laughs> um, a couple weeks back. So yay! Oh, speaking of new toys, it looks like they have all the Happy Places mermaids out. So they have the new um, little pet guys, the seashell ones with the mermaid pets. That's pretty cute. You get like a little bathtub for your color-changing mermaid friend. <laughs> and then down here they have these sets. Oh, that's cool. You get like a weird little sequin fin. So let's take a look at the mermaids. Um, I'm kind of excited for this series. I don't know if I'm going to pick some up, but I like the concept. She's really cute. She's like a little candy-themed mermaid. What? So it looks like they have four different ones in, like, the furniture packs. I really want to see, like, the single packs. I don't know what's up with the fin thing. <laughs> So here's a look, and look at your little animals. There's a larger playset. It makes for a cute little magical scene. I like the pastel colors. Happy places are always really well themed. Oh, she's adorable. So these sets are $14.99. 
which is cute. And then down here they have the larger playset, which is twenty dollars. Um, but you do get a mermaid, and then that's sort of like the home. They have a little slide. I don't know if this is the biggest playset they'll have, but it actually looks really cool. And again, very magical with the complementary colors and pastel beauty going on. So yay, another another bunch of new stuff. That's awesome. That is awesome. And then moving down, the rest of the aisle is kind of sparse. You have those little Mojimoto thingies. <laughs> That's not how you pronounce it. Bananas. And then this was where the Milo Ponies were. They don't have too much going on. But we found a lot of cool stuff. So I'm always looking for new Five Nights at Freddy stuff. This Walmart has nothing in terms of that. Um, but they do have this cool Bendy action figure, the yellow face one. I don't know what's up with that, but that's cool <laughs> and new. And then they had just the Twisted Ones mystery minis. And more action figure stuff. They actually have He-Man, Masters of the Universe, little figures going on. Oh, these are Mega Constructs, but how cool. You got Skeletor in there and other people, I don't know, but... I love the whole retro toys, and I love some minifigures, so that's kind of a neat set. I know they rebooted, like, She-Ra. That would be cool. There's Gamora. I love Gamora. She's my fave. And then down here they have some How to Train Your Dragon for the new movie coming out. The Hidden World. Oh, that's cool. So these eggs have a plushie inside. Okay, I think the black plushie is in... Oh, wait, the black egg has Toothless, pretty sure. You can kind of see the little dragon faces through it. They also have this really cool um, toothless action figure. Look at how cute he is. His wings are different, but that's cool. I'm kind of excited. I hope the movie's not sad. Look at how cute these little plushies are. That is awesome. So, yay. I'm, I'm glad to see more How to Train Your Dragon stuff. I'm sure they'll have other stuff as well. They have a cool... Uh, TIE Fighter classic toy for Star Wars. That's awesome. And then Transformers, uh, they have some of the old G1 Hot Rods. And then up here, just kind of random, random figures from the Cyberverse. And then Jurassic World. That's cool. Look at these little hatching eggs. And you get like a dino inside. I've never seen that. And then they have some of the um, new package dinosaurs going on. Which is cool. Love me some dinosaurs, and then here's some more. So, a new, different type of T-Rex going on. Cool. And then, an Optimus figure up there, too. And then, more new toys. Hatchimals are doing the mermaid thing now. So, this is the mermaid series. I don't know if there's a season number. I don't see any on the package, but... Everyone has a little mertail. That's kind of cute. So they have the larger four packs and then the two packs. Some of the eggs are are brightly colored. Let's take a look at that. Let's see. Um, hatch and splash. Oh, that little one looks pretty cute. I guess the mermaid thing is is the new unicorn thing. <laughs> oh, look at the little giraffe. They have a mischief marsh. That's adorable. So that's pretty neat. Definitely um, lots of new stuff at uh, Walmart. They still have the squishies. <laughs> cool stuff. Um, I like the, the fluorescent eggs. The figures look a little bit bigger to kind of fit the tail on. They look a little bit larger than the, the previous series, at least in my opinion. I'd have to really open them to compare the size. Cool. Okay, so I am back home from my toy hunt, and the rest of the video is a brief little haul in case you guys want to stick around and see what I purchased. And both Walmart and Target had a bunch of new toys, which that was pretty exciting. I was really happy to find the new Poopsie Sparkly Critters. They look adorable. Look at this little monkey just waving hi. Um, so Walmart had a bunch of these, and they were like $14.99, a bit pricey, but you do get the little figure, and then it can spit or poop out slime, which that's exciting. Um, and the characters just look really cute. I, I kind of like that art style, um, cute little 
critters, which I think is a fun idea and keeps sort of that poopsie art style and theme going on. So, and it's always good slime. So I'm excited to open those. And then there's the new How to Train Your Dragon, the Hidden World movie coming out. And they had these little egg plushies, but I don't think they're really blind bag because you can kind of see the dragon inside. Um, I'm assuming this is Toothless. <laughs> I kinda, he was the black egg and I love him. He's adorable and just super cute. I actually do want to see that movie. I hope it's not too sad. Um, but yeah, new How to Train Your Dragon toys coming out. So that's awesome. They only had um, the eggs and then a bigger toothless action figure. So I'm hoping that there'll be more in the future. I'll keep my eye out for those on future toy hunts. And then the last item I bought was at Target. They had these new squeeze -a mole mini plushies. Look at how tiny. This pack has a unicorn, which is adorable, and a froggy. I love frogs. And then you get a little mystery squeeze them all inside. I think these were $7.99 at Target. Um, so, and you get, you know, three little mini plushies, which I think the size is really adorable. Even if you don't use it as a squishy, just as a little mini plush. And we'll see who we get. So that is that. I'm not sure if it's going to stand. There we go. So that'll do it for this week's toy hunt. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more, feel free to subscribe to my channel. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.